Let's go slide around on some more wet pavement, shall we? We're, we're, we're getting close to the end here. All we gotta do is get gold medals on every track here. And then gold medals on the one track on the classic mode. And then, and then the, la the achievement I saved for last. And then we'll be done. Dead in the ditch gameplay? Probably. I think Sao Paulo here is probably the toughest track. Unless Austin's also raining, but... Uh, I feel like Austin is easier in general. So, I don't, yeah, I don't know. The spa was raining, but it was pretty easy. Because I have a lot of experience on that track. And I've got more experience on Austin than I do Sao Paulo, so... But we've gotten gold on Melbourne. That was probably the toughest one until Sao Paulo. Now I think it's Sao Paulo that's the toughest of the modern tracks, anyway. Montreal was easy, because there's a cheese you can do at right before the end. You can basically just cut right across the chicane. And the, so I exploited the shit out of that. <laughs> Shanghai was kind of tough, too. But we did it. Spa I did pretty quick, too. Montreal and Spa I did pretty quick. Sao Paulo is going to be more like, uh, what's that one called? Melbourne. If not longer. It's all wet and slippery. And I'm pretty good in Sector 1 and 3. At least I was last time. I'm way too slow in Sector 2, though. I need to figure out how to do the tracks. Well, it's going to try to sign me in for Ghost Data and be like, it's not available because they shut down Race Night. All that means is that you won't see, like, my personal ghost data. You'll only see, like, the uh, NPC data. Has no impact on achievements or anything. I actually did have impact on one achievement, but I already got that achievement. Anyone who didn't, uh, make a RaceNet account before the game shut down is not getting, uh... That car that you only get if you make a RaceNet account. Is not getting the achievement for that. When they shut down the servers in last month, uh, it only shut down RaceNet. So you can actually still get the co-op achievements if you want. Alright, let's go learn how to drive again. Let's go learn. No, I didn't break enough. Unbreaker, get back here, gold ghost. So the goal in time attack is to beat the gold ghost. So I have to be faster than them. Which requires, like, perfection. Or really close to perfection. <laughs> My main issue is here in Sector 2, though. These corners. This first one right here. Okay, I did it too early. I mean, I'm either too early or too late. I gotta learn how to do the corner, sure. This first corner and then this second corner. The last stream I was doing pretty well at everywhere else on the track except here. Okay, that was too, that was way too slow. But we just go around in a circle a bunch until we get good. And if we don't get it today, we try again next week. And then we keep trying until we get there. That's how this works. Practice makes better, right? Maybe not perfect, but better. First lap done. Woohoo! Getting back in the groove of things. Uh, I didn't break enough. Gonna get penalized for leaving the track. Excited for sleeping dogs. Yeah, we'll be hitting the DLC next time for sure. I've pretty much gotten all the collectibles on that game. So, uh, what do I have left to do in that game? Oh yeah, gold stats. I have to get 30 gold stat things. Unless that takes forever. I should be starting the first DLC next time. I think it is Nightmare North Point or something. Or it's the other one's called like what? You're the snake or something? It's one of those two. So whichever one in the menu is above the other one. Okay, that was a terrible corner. I wasn't in the right position for that. One of these two. That didn't break enough. Whee! 
Hard to believe my racing sim journey on this game is almost over. I just have to beat this final challenge. I'm sliding too much. That's my main issue on this track is the sliding. That's what, it, what my main issue was last week anyway. My main issue right this second is getting in the groove again. Warming back up. Learn at ah, overshot it. Learn how to drive again. Everybody got a warm up period, right? Give me a half hour, I'll be decent again, right? <laughs> uh, overshot. Uh, overshot. Breaking too late. I can't tell if that's me sliding or if that's just a sound effect in the rain. I think this is just a rain sound effect and not me sliding. Because you don't want to slide. Sliding uh, dramatically reduces your speed. So I'm trying to tell if it's me sliding or just a sound effect. And it doesn't feel like I'm sliding, so I think it's a sound effect. You can you can you can tell when you're sliding on like other tracks and stuff. Because your handling just goes out the window. It's like handling? What handling? Blah bitch. I play Shadow of the Colossus for the heck of it. That sounds like a plan. But definitely it's way too slow. Whee! I got all those cool trophies. No, that's just me. You, you can just play and not get trophies if you want. I'm the crazy trophy hunter here. Hmm, that might be a pretty good turn, maybe. Okay, that's a slide. See, I lost control there. That's definitely a slide, not just a sound effect. I'd like to think the NPC is sliding too as he's racing off into the sunset. I hope Austin's not raining or I'm going to cry. Yeah, I'll be fine. I'll probably have an easier time on Austin than this track when I get to it. Which is why I must conquer this one first. I refuse to go to Austin and do it first. I must do them in order. Ooh, I did that much better. He didn't get ahead of me right away like last time. That's closer to what I need to do. <laughs> I break too much. We just go around and around making little notes of what we did and didn't do right. And eventually we adjust and get better. Okay, he's not as far away this time. I slid there. Rip. Uh. He's not quite as far ahead of me this time, though. That's a sign of improvement. Oh, I didn't break enough. <clears throat> Rest in peace. Actually, when should I start on the, uh... Curves? There's no DRS this time. Is it, you, don't, you don't have DRS in the rain. I didn't break enough. Rip. You guessed that. I can't think of any other game that would be SOTC other than Shadow of the Colossus. It doesn't have a confusing acronym. You say G-O-W, I'd be like, is that God of War? Is that Gears of War? I don't know. Not too many other SOTCs out there, though. In fact, I can't think of any other ones. I'm 
Uh, break. Ah, not breaking. Uh, accelerating too much there. What I was doing there. Ooh, that's pretty good. I'm gonna pay attention to my racing lawn. Give me all the clues on when to break. And I surprisingly have not had to turn manual gears on yet. Supposedly that'll save you a little bit more time, like four hundredths or whatever. You could do a turn four hundredths faster if you turn off... Oop, I forgot to do curse. I'm gonna pay for that on this lap. Well, maybe not. Maybe not in the first quarter. Since you have to break right away. Rip. You have to break right away anyway. That might it might not matter. Some of the tracks say you want to be going as fast as possible at the start of a new lap. Hey Pyro, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? I'm going out of the track here. Oh, I didn't break fast enough here. I think I did that one better than him, actually. I think I slid at the end a bit, though. I'm not quite as far behind this time. Perhaps we warm it up. Mr. Driver said, I've won F1 2013. I cried. You did? Oh, no. Oh, I mean, it was a happy moment, though, right? Happy tears? Yeah, they do that turn faster than I do. I've got to learn to be more aggressive without overshooting the turn. I did that turn better than them, though. Just slightly, though. Get back here, you bastard. Uh, I keep overshooting that. We go around and around until we get good. The downside is that I have to do it all perfectly on one lap. I can't flashback if I fuck up because that invalidates your lap. You have to do it all perfectly in one go. So is that it's pretty tough. It's definitely tougher than the races. One upside though is you don't have other cars to watch out for. You can't crash into that ghost. Uh, I definitely fucked that up. That was, that was, that was rough. I'm surprised I didn't go out of the side of the track. So the target's 119.17, huh? My PB as of last week was still over a second behind. I might be here the whole stream, you know? Oh, maybe. Oh. Well, I think I break too late. I think you went too late there, too. Oh. Accelerated too quickly. We'll get it eventually, though. If I was able to get gold in the last four, I can get gold in this one. Although it took me like 50 laps for a couple of the uh, tracks. Oh wait, I've done like 25 laps of this one already. So this is like 35. I think this one's definitely going to take the most laps because of the wet track. If this was dry, this would be totally different. I probably would have done it already. It's the, it's the sliding around in the wet that's making it tougher. Want to sleep, take care. You got this, bestie. Oh yeah, I got this. Hopefully tonight. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. 
You have a good sleep, Dean. You need to take care of yourself. Eight hours, okay? That's totally a pro rule. Well, no, it's not. You do your best, though. You do your best. Ha 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 ha. Oh, didn't break. Invalidated. Well, I'll be ahead of him, though, right? See? Uh, nope. Even when I cut across the track, he's still faster than me. Almost like he, he, you get an advantage by. Do you sleep eight hours? No. You're not supposed to do as I do, man. I wish I slept eight hours. That'd be nice. If I slept eight hours, I probably wouldn't need to nap later. And then uh, start stream late because I was napping. You're supposed to do as I say, not as I do, right? Right, right, right. First one is sharper, I think, than the second one. Got it. <laughs> hmm. I'm only one point two seconds. Well, I did cut across, though. So I don't know if this is uh, that good in terms of comparing to my PB last time. A little bit slower. Oh, I did that one pretty well. It's only passing me now. I'm gonna go off. Rip. I uh, uh, accelerated too much there. I'll be a little too aggressive. Now I know I can't do that though. The learning process. Break too early actually that time. break enough that time. Fix your restless legs at least. Good, good, good! I'll have a nice comfy sleep now. Get an idea of what to do in that first corner, at least. I think part of it is also the fact that we're in what Marussia cars, not like Ferraris. The handling's not as good as it would be on a Ferrari car. Okay, he speeds up more here. Oh, I went out again, but he was getting ahead of me there, so I started accelerating. Bah, bah, bah. Not too far behind, just a little bit. Although I did take a penalty, so it wouldn't matter anyway. If I was ahead that time or not. My lap had already been invalidated. Ah, uh, this one's fucked. Rip. I was at the wrong angle for that. I didn't break enough is what it was. was pretty close though. That's definitely the closest one I've had. And I went outside of the track there too. 
I can feel it. I feel I feel the gold coming sometime soon, okay? I feel it coming sometime soon. Three hours later. It's actually pretty slow right there. Slide. Rip. Rest in peace. Managed to keep control, but you lose a lot of speed sliding, so. Bye, car. See you later. See you next lap. How do I not go off there? I have to figure out how to maximize the speed there. Because they only seem to slow down slow down at that first corner and then they just keep going. Maybe they slow down a bit for the next corner though. Overshot. It's a learning process. Not as far behind as I expected for that big fuck up I did at the beginning, honestly. I expected him to be at the finish line by this point. <laughs> you can't escape from me, car. I will find you. I will. I will get you. Yeah, that wasn't very good, but that was better than last lap, so. Uh-oh. They didn't count that as leaving the track, really? You clearly slow down here, and you break there. Overshot it. Kind of overshot this one, too. But I didn't do, do that one as bad as the last one. I'm consistently not as far behind. You better watch out, gold. Can you honk? Sadly, no. You can't. It'd be cool, though, if you could. You can honk your cars and sleeping dogs. I overshot that. Rest in peace to slip. And if you're in the police cars, you can use your siren too. But no honking in this game, I'm afraid. I doubt they even have horns installed, to be honest. Like, what use would you have for a horn in a racing game? Is someone going to move out of the way if you honk at him? I doubt it. I don't see the functional use of a horde in a racing car. The typical etiquette to honk your horn as you pass somebody? I don't know. I've been doing it all wrong then. Breaking too early. 
my problem there. Break too early. Oh, I didn't break enough here. I did that a bit early, but that might actually be good. I don't know. I'm conflicted on that one. I mean better than nothing? Hmm. Oh no. Well, that was pretty good. Shouldn't have slid like that, but... Well, actually, I actually kind of got ahead there, so maybe I should slide like that. I thought that was going to count me as outside the track there, but it did not. Oh, that actually ended up being ahead of him. That's pretty cool. Only by point oh fifteen, but still. I'm sliding. Rip. I'm pretty good there, but I fucked that corner up too. Goodbye. Slide and lost me that. And then I fucked up that second corner. Slide and lost me that one. How much time I lost? I'm kind of figured out how to do that first corner now after that last lap, though. Watch me forget next lap. Ah, rip. I fucked that up. Goodbye! 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 Getting closer, though. That's gonna count as corner cut. Is that it? What the fuck? Really? Alright. If you say so again. That was sloppy. Sloppy! I still haven't beaten my PB. <laughs> That's sad. It's because I, I can start out strong, but I have to do the whole lap well, right? Oh. Uh, I don't do well at all the corners, then uh, I'm not going to beat my PB. Or get gold. Rip. So much sliding. That was a terrible corner, too. I need to break early enough to get, like, in the 
inner corner, apex, whatever you want to call it. Not the outer corner, the inner corner. That's terrible. I'm gonna end up ahead here because I was sliding. But I actually ended up better than I thought I was going to. I break too early. Like way too early there. Goodbye! Like I'm saying, one mistake and boom, he's ahead of me and I'm not getting it back. You gotta be like, perfect. That was too wide. I'm getting better though. And sometimes I do a corner well. I just have to learn to do all the corners well in one lineup. That's the tough part. Yes, I cuss out my fellow AI drivers. How dare they get in my way of my achievement. I can't believe you don't get penalized for that. That was the best one I've done. Point two ninety. That's crazy. Yeah, I just deleted my advantage though. Yeah, I did. I break too much there. Break too early here too. Do, 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 do. Closer, though. I'm getting an idea of how to do that first corner. That second corner, though, needs some work. And then all the other corners in existence. Got a new PB. Not a very good one. Ah, that was pretty good second corner, though. Or really more like third or fourth or whatever, but still. do that very well. Flipping and sliding. Lost my advantage. I don't think I ever had the advantage on this lap. Wasn't quite so smooth that time. Rip. Goodbye.
Way too early. Well, yeah, maybe not. Quite okay on those corners, I think, actually. Yeah, I fucked up this one. Rip. Validated my laugh there. Didn't break enough. Do, 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 do. Can driving games improve real life driving? Same with first person shooting, but shooting in real life? I kind of doubt that. Like, maybe if you did, like, it's an actual wheel. Controller, though, like me? Nah. I also highly doubt being good at a first person shooter would improve your actual skills with holding a gun and firing it, too. I would think only maybe if you're using like a controller that simulates the real thing. Like an actual racing wheel, like a gun controller or something, maybe then? If it's realistic. If you're just using a video game controller, uh, no. I, I doubt it. It might improve your, uh... What do you call that? How fast you notice things? Your spatial awareness or whatever? Your reaction time, maybe. Just my opinion, though. <laughs> Hug six feet! What's up, Tap? How's it going, Alterator? How you doing to that? I can't believe you can kind of cheese that corner there. I'm gonna go off. Rip. Don't get too fast. Late, I think there. I think I can do that better. It's more practice. We've now practice as much as we did on this track last week. So we did 25 laps last week. Not no closer. It's the sliding, I'm telling you. Going good, how's you? I'm doing pretty well. I'm trying to get my gold medal on this track. Which means being faster than this gold ghost. This guy needs to learn to slow down and, you know, enjoy life or something. I fucked that up. Hardcore. Goodbye. This guy needs to learn how to slow down and enjoy life, man. Stop going so fast. That. Too much acceleration. Stretch. Okay. I felt that. 
you just could go faster, you got it. I'm an old lady, you know, I'm gonna go slower now. Meow! Uh, Alright, right, let's go press some buttons again. I'm breaking a little too early, I think. Ah, uh, yep. That, this is what happens when you... What? I'm just sliding all over the place. This is what happens when you stretch! Actually, I don't think that's it. Slap. Too bad there's no go but be, go to next lap button, but I guess I need to practice on the whole track anyway, so it's whatever. Is Chloe fast? I mean, she's probably faster than I am. She's a cat after all. I don't think she's faster than these F1 cars, though. I only do the corners perfectly when, uh, there's no pressure. Because the Gold Ghost is already far ahead of me. Although I've been doing some sliding around anyway, so I would have lost it anyway. I've been doing too much sliding here. I gotta not slide. That's the main challenge on this one, the wet track. Not the course itself. That was kind of eh. I didn't go out off the track this time, though. Didn't break enough, I don't think. Nope. Oh, rip. Bah. Can I find the balance between aggressive and uh, not flying off the track there. Breaking too late. Doo, 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 doo. The thing is, is that this car isn't that fast in the corners either, so that's where I need to take my advantage. I need to not fuck up sections like here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Not as good as I've done, but still. The, the, I need to beat him in the corners. I just need to do everything faster than them. That's what I need to do. I've gotten gold. Oh, I'm gonna go off again. I've gotten golds on the uh, ones on the previous tracks where he, this ghost was ahead of me until I got ahead of them on one of the corners toward the end or whatever. I don't have to be ahead of him the entire time. I just have to be able to catch up and beat him. That said, I think you can stay ahead the whole time on this one without much issue. You just do that first corner right, and then the next corner right, and then the next corner right, and then it repeat throughout all of history. So I'm doomed, in other words. Ugh. No!
It's gonna be a left to track, yeah. Rip. That was too aggressive a corner. <laughs> it didn't get me that far ahead anyway. Ah, this is too early. Break too early. Yeah, he only breaks like a little bit. Ah, too early. Well, actually, that one kind of works out. Ah, I fucked that up. My good driver pro, generally speaking, I'd like to think so. I might be biased, though. Waited too long to accelerate, I think, there. My brake was pretty good, though. Turn was pretty good. Pretty good here. Ooh, if I stay on track here, this would be a PB. Back to Dow. What? New PB acquired. I didn't break enough the next turn. Rip. Alright, we've gotten two PBs. We're getting closer. I can't do two good laps in a row, though, okay? Then tugs from six feet away. Yeah! Imagine just, like, six-foot-long sticks with, like, hands on the end or something. Hugs! Uh-oh. I overdid it there again. Biden's not gonna make you faster, pro. That's too early there. Hey, Dolby, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? You're just in time. I'm totally got it. Got it this lap. No, I don't. Rip. Finish jocks at one. All done. Congratulations! If I do that right, I can totally get ahead there. And I slid like an idiot. Slid like a fucking moron. And I'm sliding again. Goodbye. I'm telling you, the only reason this is tough is the wet track. I would have had this done by now if it was dry. It's just the fucking sliding. 
being disappointed. Me too. I wish this car would just park in the garage and let me do this lap. I've gotten two PBs though, so I'm getting closer. One lap at a time, right? I didn't break enough. Rip. I was ahead of him not that one lap though. Into sector one. Sector two is my main issue after all. Let's see what you hope to tonight. I told you I wasn't going to finish this game today. The hard one is supposed to be the one on Classic. That one's going to take me four streams when we get there. There's two wet. I fucked this one up hard. Rip. Rest in peace this lap. Alright, probably easiest track. No, I told you. The walkthrough guide person says that the classic time attack is the hardest of all the tracks. And it took them like seven hours, and they were someone who had played the previous four F1 games. It's not gonna be. It's not gonna be seven hours for me. It's probably gonna be like twenty hours for me. I'm thoroughly intimidated. And this whole lap is just fucked. I fucked up like every single corner of this lap. Right, let's do this one well. I did okay on this one. That, never mind. I did terrible on all, all the quarters on this lap. Did you stop spinning, please? Thank you. Hey, Ivor. What's up? What's up? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Well, you know what? What's what the good news is, Dolby? We can, when we find out if the classic track is actually as hard as I've read about, that means I'll have beaten Sao Paulo and Austin after this. I'm doing them in order. Not very good, but at least I didn't go off track, so. Tired, about to go to sleep. Oh, you have a good sleep! Thanks for stopping by. I didn't break enough. Al Paulo, that's the track I'm on right now. That's probably not how you pronounce it, right? That's how I'm pronouncing it, though. Wait, didn't someone... Didn't I watch the hot lap when they said it that way? I didn't break enough. Goodbye. Goodbye, cruel world. Yeah, that's the track I'm on right now is Sao Paulo. Mm, uh, last one in the modern, which is the next one, is Austin, Texas. It'll be very exciting. I'm much better at that track than I am at this one. Uh, unless it's raining, in which case maybe I won't be.
Oh, I did that pretty well. I'm scared. Oh, Alright, we can fix that here. got ahead of me. Too bad. You can't catch up to them if they get ahead of you like this. Not even with curves. Got close though. But close only counts in horseshoes. Not in racing. Do, 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 do. Gotta head me again here. So he's doing the second corner better than me. How dare you! Close selling cows and horseshoes, man. I was slower than my last lap, too. Oh, I overshot. This one's toast. Ugh. Ooh. I was, oh, I'm was. i less than a hundredths behind, huh? Like, eight, 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 what do we call that? We call that a slow bout. I'm really close to getting my goal. I didn't see why he beat this game tonight anyway. I mean, I got close to doing two laps in a row there. That's pretty good. I just need one of those ones where I get a good lead ahead in the first corner. And then I just do the rest of the track well like I did those other two laps. I overshot this one. I just stay hide. They're getting closer though. Practice makes better. How far is the richest state in Brazil? Is it? I didn't know that. They should have some covered tracks so that I don't get rained on then if they're so rich. I overshot. Look this one up too. Goodbye. You're not catching up at this point. You didn't want to see me beat the game tonight anyway? Me neither. I've only been on this game for like half a year, right? Not, the, not quite that long. This is the 20th stream of this game though. So getting, getting closer to half a year of streams of this game. We didn't need to move on to the next Xbox 360 or whatever game in our backlog. I've started but not completed. We don't need to do that anyway. Let's option my nose, you know. Hey Mexican boy, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Believe in me. Hooray! I kind of stopped paying attention to driving on this lap since I'm so far behind anyway. That uh, just makes perfect this goddamn. Right? That's goddamn right. Give me that JoJo game. No! 
Ruffle barf. Rip. Invalidated. Goodbye. I don't know how I take that angle. I can actually get better, better than them at that one. Oh, I'm sliding. Rip. Rip. Sliding again. I'm telling you, the challenge is the slot, the wet, the sliding. Because you have to more gradually accelerate. You can't just... Boom. You still have to gradually accelerate anyway, even on dry tracks. But it's definitely more noticeable on the wet tracks. I'm good, how about you? I'm doing pretty well. We're getting our time attack practice in here. As you can see in the top right, we've gotten really close to getting gold. Only missed it by a hundredth, a single hundredth or something. Way over shot. Wait, was hundredths like the first one after the decimal, right? Right? I totally know numbers. Our best is seven point or point seven nine eight, and the one we need to beat is point seven ten. We've gotten really fucking close. It's only a matter of time. I overshot that. Stop sliding, bro. Are you a sliding little bitch? Yes. A stretch. <gasps> I can't stretch and drive at the same time. Hey, what's up? What's up? What's happening? How's it going? Bonjour to you too. I bet that's just the exact way they pronounce it in French. Bonjour. Actually, do they pronounce the J's? I don't fucking know. Maybe they do. Ah. Or meh. At least you're not in the soaking rain sliding around this track. I suppose. Hope you do better luck. I don't have numbers either. A lot of pain. Oh no! Hope you can get medicine and stuff to take care of that. That's never any fun. Never ever. I break too early. We gotta focus now, okay? We gotta focus. Rip. Too aggressive. I kind of fucked up the first corner, though. Alright, focus mode off. Pain is no bueno, that's right. He gets ahead of me at that early, I'll never catch him back up. Not ever. I'm gonna just stay ahead of him the whole track, I'm pretty sure. Some of the other ones I've been able to have him be ahead and then catch up later. Not this one though, I feel like this one I have to stay ahead of him the whole time. I can cheese the second part of that corner, first quarter, or whatever. I can cheese it a little bit. I just have to do it correctly. Which involves breaking at the right time. Ah, I just break too late there. Alright, I guess it's time to turn focus mode back on.
Oh, rip. I somehow did not get penalized. But that's not a good time. He's going to be ahead of me here. I break too early. Rip! Focus mode back off. You're not that far ahead of me. No, oh, it's golf's fault. Maybe you should take a break from golf for some time. You recover. Oh yeah. I, 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 getting like your skin scrapes is never fun at all, no. Never ever. Ah. I'm gonna get penalized for that. I didn't get penalized for that. I didn't do that corner very well though. That's GG right there. Sad. I feel like me doing the first corner is going to decide how the rest of the race goes. And I break too late for this one, too, anyway. I'm not doing the rest of it well enough that I can actually catch up. If I do that one right, though, and this one good, then I can catch up. But the rest of it, I don't think I have a good uh, chance to catch up. Goodbye, car. He needs to just pop a tire or something. Pop one of his ghost tires. I think I'm breaking too late here. That's going to be left to track, right? Oh! Okay. Alright. That's kind of the cheese I'm talking about. I feel like I should get penalized for that. does the second corner better than me. And I can't catch up if he gets ahead of me here because the curve just doesn't have enough oomph to do that. But I need to straight up be ahead of him. And stay ahead of him here. I break to it. Too early. I fucked this one up hardcore. Rip. Uh, this slap's done. Yeah, I think you need to give your hands a break from the golf. Any time to heal. You're not supposed to damage them like that, you know. You youngins. Always overworking. Hereby are only allowed to play golf with uh, the hand that's not all banged up. If they're both banged up, then you're you're banned for like a week or something. That's totally a pro order. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm.
Not as good as it could have been. Because he's going to close the gap here. Because he's just straight up faster at this part. Yep, I'm fucking up that second corner hardcore. I'm sabotaging it. I cut across the grass is probably my issue. As I break too early. Your hands aren't the issue, really? Your feet, your feet, huh? Well, uh, your feet need a break too. Ah, dang. I got penalized for that one. I didn't get that good a, uh... Lead, anyway. I don't think cutting off your feet's gonna help. You can't just get robot feet. And have them function the same, at least. You should just take it easy. Give them a nice bath or something. Time to uh, give them a break. Yeah, I give up this lap. I'll give up this lap. How dare you make me slide? What whore? Well, that was lap 50, huh? Far on. You can kind of cheese that, but I'm going too far in. Going too far in also slows you down more, too, so. The best one I ever did was like 0 .290 or something ahead. I've only been able to do that once on one singular lap, and then I immediately bombed it and threw it away with the next, uh, uh this wasn't a good turn. Immediately bombed it and threw it away with the next one. Interesting. I was able to not lose any ground by staying on the edge there. He's definitely doing that second cor corner better than me. I'm not sure exactly what he's doing. Going on the outside and then going in, I guess. Didn't do that well. I don't think. No, it's okay. How could?
Go, 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 go. I don't know if I'll get this or not, honestly. Yes! That was close. Uh, I got adrenaline right now. I, I, need, I need a moment. I realized I was actually doing it like right before the last uh, corner. I was like, ah, don't fuck up, don't fuck up, don't fuck up, don't fuck up. Uh, Yes, we'll up. Give your limbs a bath or something. Give them some nice medicine. Give them a break. Let's save it. Well, we did it by like 150 hundreds or something. 170 hundreds? Something? Really close. That said, Melbourne was closer than that. Congratulations, medal awarded, Sao Paulo. You won a gold medal at Sao Paulo in Time Attack. Yeah! If I'm lucky, that was the toughest one right there. But, I, I, I doubt it. I still think the classic one's gonna be the toughest. I don't think Austin's gonna be as tough, though. I hope it's not raining. We're gonna see in a little bit. We're gonna see! Okay! Alright, let's go see what Austin's like. Will it be wet or dry? If it's dry, then it probably just depends on my car. Well, uh, of course, re-familiarizing myself with the track. I got beat up bronze and silver first. <gasps> it's dry! Yes! Woohoo! Goodbye, Rain. Wasn't a corner cut? Oh, it's this one. With these sharp corners. Which car is this? Sure. Ah, which one this is? I I gotta learn track anyway. This is fun. This one might be Caterham. I don't know. Wait, Bo Bo the Fo. I don't know which one this is. I got DRS right now. I honestly forgot all about DRS after all the wet track. In breaking time. Oh. Still sliding. here but you don't really get enough time to fully use your curves here
Well, I thought I could use part of my curse here, like half of it. Should be on my best behavior since I'm trying to get bronze here, right? Go and drive around beating bronze all day. At least go get to silver. Dang, Silver did that better than me. I feel thoroughly intimidated, though. I never know what to do with this corner in particular. Ah, you fucking bitch. You fucking bitch. I always break too early. I was doing that in races, too. I was breaking too early on that one. Laps and validated already anyway, so uh, who cares? Even silver silver's kicking my there air. Maybe this one will be tough because of my vehicle. I don't know about that. I'm not that far behind silver. doing better there okay all right silver showed me how I'm supposed to drive the track instead of my pro wet Break too late. Rip my lap. Rip. Why didn't equal death? Silver shouldn't be too tough, though. I'm just not doing it right.
So if I'm behind you, I can kind of get an idea of what you're doing. Other than not overshooting all these corners like I am. Not sure, even though Silver's kicking my derriere. I'm just happy to be on a new track. That's right, that's right, Mexican boy, that's right. <coughs> I keep overshooting my corners. Uh, this is lap five, though. Give me time, okay? <coughs> I'm not even doing the first corner right if Silver can beat me there. <clears throat> Shoot on. I feel like that racing line is going too far out. I swear. I swear. I swear. Uh, this is pretty sharp, actually. I ain't toasting that shit. Corner cut? No! That's pretty good. No! Ah! Oh, I somehow didn't get penalized. Okay, okay, okay. Somehow, Subway.
GG, Silver. Now it's time for the real challenge. Kind of goes off there. What the hell? Well, it wasn't a very good corner. Fucking games don't make you a better chef. Hmm, I don't know about that. They would teach you a lot of things. I guess the game can recommend your recipes. Yeah, they, they could teach you, like, what, what spices work best together, you know. How to make dishes and stuff. I can tell you how to do the cooking techniques. That's not quite the same as actually doing them, but... They could be very educational and informative. I don't know why I tapped on the accelerator there. Because I'm a fool. I wanted to see the gold ghost get ahead of me again. It's exciting. Watch her slow down here. Me catch up here. It's very exciting. And then go fly off. And then he goes flies off. It's a good time. I feel like I could totally abuse that section. If I do it right. Breaking too late. Rip. Rest in peace, lap. Rest in pieces. I'm not used to this less like responsive braking. It's like a dry track. I'm not used to it. I'm supposed to slide around everywhere. Don't you know? Don't you know? Don't you know? Hmm. Don't you know? Pierce his tires, bro. I wish I could, but he's a ghost. You can't pierce the tires of somebody who's a ghost. Ah, uh, you start... I didn't start out the track fast enough. Are you starting with a disadvantage? In the corner pretty well, though, since he didn't get ahead of me by a lot there. Didn't do that very well. I'd love to pierce his tires, uh. Sadly, you can't do that to ghosts. 
Got a Ouija tablet. And hire somebody from the other side. Oh, I see. Hmm, you can try it, but I don't think it's gonna work for some reason. Wonder what to pay a ghost? Spooky ghost currency, obviously. Ah, rip. Rip. That's the risk with my strategy is the there is getting the corner cut warning. Too spooky, spooky to put in your wallet. Ooh, that does sound pretty spooky. I just did that corner back there better than me, huh? I didn't break enough. <clears throat> hey Goose Fridge, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? I don't know why my hands did that, though. I was trying to hit the ball or not go next to it. Rip. Yeah, that wasn't very well done, either. I'm not faster if I'm only faster because I cheated, you know. You get infinite tries, pro? Yeah. I just go around and around and around until I win. I could do nine billion laps if I want to. Mode's called Time Attack. Your goal is to beat uh, the ghost. You get a faster time. And just uh, finish the last track, which was Sao Paulo, after like 75 laps or something of trying. Probably over 75, actually. I don't remember what my final lap number was. It was like 25 last stream and 50 plus this stream. Now we're on this track. This is the last of the modern tracks to do. After that, I get classic track to do. And then I will be done with time attack. And just about done with the game. Yeah, I knew that was going to punish me. <laughs> it went too fast. I want to find the maximum cheese for that area, though. I liked the first talks very much. It was great. Good, 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 good. I'll have to get around to trying it myself sometime. I 
many games to play, so little time. Uh, I overshot that by like five miles. Hey, you'll enjoy Kiwami if the 2005 is really good. Yeah, I bet it's only better. Look sharper and stuff. A little luscious sausager. Interesting name. What's up? What's happening? How's it going tonight? How many laps I want to make? How many it takes to get gold medal? Rip. Just went off track. I did that entirely the wrong angle. Wee! The goal here is to get all the achievements in the game because I'm an achievement hunter or a trophy hunter or whatever. I do both PlayStation and Xbox. So I'm working on getting all the achievements in this game. And there's one for getting gold medals on each of the time attack tracks. This is the sixth time attack track in modern. And also the last one in modern. It's the second to last track for me to master. Why am I using all my curves? I don't know. Oh, too late. Too late! Trying to do, uh, I'm trying to test to see how late I can wait to break before it's too far, you know. That's the only way you beat the gold, gold ghost is by, uh, breaking at just the right time. Doing everything at just the right time or as close to perfect as you can get. So I keep testing to see how far I can get. That's when it was over overshot. Overshot, overshot, over, over, overshot. Not too bad, though. And that was pretty good. He did that one way better than me. Alright, this is where I lose. Yeah! This is where I fumble. I was doing so well, too. Obviously, I gotta improve this part of the track. Did your tip forcefully get home? Ugh. Fun grinding, thank you, thank you. I hope your wait goes by really quickly and you get to go home soon. Don't forget the rest of the eat now and then. True, true, true. I fucked this up. I recovered it as best I could, but...
Do, 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 do. I gotta work on that last later part of the track anyway. I don't think this will take 75 laps like the last one did. I keep overshooting this. That's where I fucked up last time too. That's the corner I gotta work on. I didn't do very well at this one either, but... <clears throat> I know which corners I have to improve. No sliding, please, pro. No slippy slide. This ain't a rainy track. Is there a drift mechanic? Nah, this is a sim racing game. There's no drifting. Drifting dramatically slows you down. You don't want to drift in this game. This isn't an arcade racing. This is more realistic. You can drift, but you don't want to. You drift, everybody else races past you, and you, they're off in the sunset. This is my first sim racing game, so it's been a learning experience. I still overshot that. Still overshot that. Oh, hydrate. Okay, okay, okay. Careful not drifter. I try not to drift. Whenever you hear my tiles, tires go like, that's, that's me slipping. Uh, 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 which is like baby drifts, right? I was doing lots of sliding on the last track I was doing because it was raining. So I had to beat the Gold Ghost on a wet track. It was a good time. Lots of sliding. This one's dry, though, at least. I don't feel like this one will take me as many tries as the last track. Last track took me like 80 laps around to do. I think the last one's going to be the toughest one. I said this one's... I'd say this one's tougher than Montreal and, uh, Spa. I'll put this one in, like, third place, I think. For the modern ones, I think Sao Paulo's the toughest one. It's just the one I just did earlier. And then Melbourne, which I did last week. And I'd put this one as third toughest. Fourth toughest after I try the classic track, right? <laughs> This is the second to last track hat. Isn't that exciting? We're almost there. To get uh, the achievements for uh, Time Attack, you have to get gold medals on seven different tracks. This is the sixth one. Second to last. Hope you're doing well tonight, cat. What's up, Seth? How's it going? Hmm. I don't think this one will be as tough, but... I need to figure out those two corners back there. In particular. I can get ahead of gold with the curvy section if I do it right. I need to keep it, which means not fucking up those two corners. I'm gonna overshot. Right. Uh, too early. Break too early. Ah, fuck that up. I didn't do this one very well. 
That, that's some that's the drifting you're not supposed to do. Kinda paid out this time though, because I didn't drift into a wall. And I actually somehow did not get penalized for going off track. Why well, I don't know. Not this lap. Not this lap. Yeah, better luck next lap. Making too many mistakes. Get gold, you have to be really close to perfect. You don't have to be absolutely perfect, you just have to be really fucking close. You have to be better than the AI. Most easily exploitable place here is... The little S-curves back and forth in the beginning. If I think if I can get ahead there and just do well and all the, all the rest of it, we can go. We got it. We'll see, we'll see though. It'll be whatever it'll be. You can't just penalize me for corner cutting at the end. What? At least I didn't penalize my next lap. But I fucked this one up hardcore, man. I really fucked up that first turn there. That's super fucked. Let's try max speed and drift once you mention drag and drop. Uh, uh. Max speed and drift, huh? Whee! Bop. I can't drift on command. It's more like just sliding when you're turning. There's no drift button, per se. When you're, like, going too fast and you just slide. And you hit all the things. Yep, thank you. You're welcome. Now well, let's go back for next lap. Since I'd already fucked up that first corner of this lap anyway. Better luck next lap. Hmm, not too bad. No sliding! I didn't do that one very well. Man, I overshot that one too. I'm gonna be slow on starting on this lap. Yep. Do, 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 do. Already starting at a disadvantage. I knew that one was going to get me. The fine balance between doing it well and, uh, you know, getting penalized. If you get penalized, your time's not going to count. So even if I beat this guy, which has happened in previous tracks, I've beaten the guy that it doesn't count because I got myself penalized. It doesn't matter if I beat him right now or not. That upper red bar in the top right says no. This is no good time for you. You penalized. Yo, bad driver. You must stay on course. No corner cut. You cannot drive through grass. You must do a good job. And be faster than the other guy. I think it's a tall order. Come on. Stay on the track. Insanity. Insanity.
See, if you do it well, you can get a good distance out of him here. You just have to do well the rest of the track, too. That's why I immediately did that really slow and terrible. Got me here. Rip. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do it until I stop sucking at this. Oh, I overshot this so bad. I'm not gonna be able to do it until I can do these corners. I can beat him in the beginning and it doesn't fucking matter. It's not gonna matter until I can do those corners without being terrible. That's a corner cut right there. Why would I care if that lap where I lost anyway got penalized? Why, why would I give a shit? I don't! Too wide. Rip. Really, the problem there was breaking too early. That's gonna be a penalty. Yeah, I knew it. No point in the doing well if I don't keep my time. I know I can do that without getting penalized. Doesn't matter though, I need to be able to do the rest of this course without sucking. I just need a lap where I do that first part well and don't get penalized. And then not be terrible here. Dude, that one was pretty good. But he's getting ahead of me, so I guess it wasn't good enough. No, I slid. I don't want no drift. No drifts. No drift. Ah. Goodbye. We'll get you one of these laps. You watch out, buddy. We just need more practice. Nah, okay, I guess. Damn you! That's not a fucking corner cut, you little bitch. Stop fucking penalizing me. Fuck you. How dare you. How dare you! I was going along the outer edge. That's not a fucking corner cut. A corner cut is when you cut the corner, not go along the outer edge of a turn. <laughs> At least call it out of bounds or something, not a corner cut. I disagree with the terminology. Ooh. Yeah, he's definitely better than me at this corner. See, he's like caught up to me. He just straight up does this the last two corners better than me. I don't know what I'm doing wrong with him either. Being too slow. Well, I got like five billion more laps to try, so that's what counts. Thank you. 
Mm, you're getting better with me again. I did better that time, though. Ah, rip. Oh, that's gonna fuck up my next lap. Yep. <clears throat> You're too slow at the end of the last lap. It's going to affect your starting speed on the next one, so. I knew that was going to be a corner cut, but it doesn't matter. This lap was fucked to begin with. This lap was screwed up to heckity hacks to begin with. This lap was toast. Bonk. Remember the red brown with one wheel? I'll leave that too. See, drag it down a little bit if you do two wheel on it. True. True. I'll get it though. I just need to do better on these corners, starting to this one. Hey, I overshot that. I do pretty good on the first half of the track. I'm not optimizing this half of the track. And sliding like that just slows you down. Every time you slide like that, you lose a lot of speed. I'll get it one of these times. I just have to do everything well in the same lap. And you can't use flashbacks to like fix any mistakes because that invalidates your lap time. So you have to do everything well in one singular lap. The races are easier than the time attack, honestly, because you can flashback if you fuck up. Eh, this isn't a very good fast time either. Better than the last one, but not a good starting time. Yep, I slid there. But yes, you're right that you do lose speed if you go on the edge. Which doesn't matter too much here. I'm trying to cheese that. I did pretty well if I managed to recover from a losing position there. Stop sliding, pro. Rip. Rip for teaching while driving. Super teaching while driving. Get an idea of what he's doing here, though, at least. Ah. See, that drifting slows you down. That's not that's not a shortcut right there. I did not take a shortcut. I slowed myself down and gave him more of a lead. You do not want to slide like that in a sim racing game. This ain't no arcade. Rip.
Oh, overshot. Goodbye. 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 That. That's gonna be off track. Yeah, I did. Knew it. That was this. This lap was toast anyway. Our battery makes you lose connection to the road. Ugh. You drop out of the red boundary. You got yourself a drift and make you went to the outside. That's just a lot of words for I didn't do it very well. And I need to practice more. I didn't break enough here. We will get it with practice. I got gold on all the other tracks so far. After much practice. And this one too shall crumble. One of these times I have a good lap and don't mess up. Overshot it. I'm going to get ahead of me here. Ah, might lose track. Yeah, I'm going to go outside the track. Rip. Too fast. Rest in peace. You can cuss through that, though. If you angle it right, you can just coast on through. And that actually gains you a lot of ground against this guy. So I can get pretty far ahead. If I do that section back there, right? But then I fuck up here. I don't do these very well and he catches up and passes me. So this is the part I need to focus the most on. Ah! That's gonna fuck up my next lap. Rip. Surprisingly, did that better than I thought. Ah, rip, 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 Rest in peace. Make this stability slow as precise. Precise as fast. True. True. I'm 
and driving in the grass and stuff is so cool and exciting. I want to do that. Not to stay on the road nonsense. <sighs> ah, I fucked that up. I like, I like started sliding, and then I overcompensated for it, try to fix that. Rest in peace. Corner cut. There you go, there you go, there you go. I knew that one was going to be a corner cut. I didn't make mean to go that far in. My hands and my brain don't always agree. I see what I need to do, but your hands doing the thing is like a totally different thing from your brain understanding what to do, you know? Like fighting a Dark Souls boss. You're like, okay, I know what I need to do to beat this boss. But then, like, actually doing the things, you know? Just all real life wheel. That's true. A wheel probably would make it easier. I've been doing this whole game on a controller. I'm sure that's made it tougher, too. But I'm not buying a wheel just for this game. Not a chance. Especially not when I'm so close to finishing the game and getting all the achievements. Oh, rip. My next lap is toast. Hello, detailed. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? It's not a corner cut? Okay. You say so, game. Who's too slow? Corner cut, corner cut. That, that corner cut. See, you can kind of recklessly do that and get ahead of the AI here. No, that's not how you do it IRL, okay. Ah! Uh, he got me ahead of me here because I fucked that up. I really fucked that up. Maybe I'll make it easier and harder at the same time. I'll do that. Old new controls to learn. Too far. Uh, what the hell am I doing there? I don't know what I was doing there. I guess I wanted to drive off into the wall. Maybe I just wanted to crash in the wall. You're good, though. Good, good, good! Well, I'm trying to get gold medals on time attack. I fucked up this first turn here. You're gonna get ahead of me here. This is the last modern track. This is the second to last one to get gold medals on. We got a gold medal for Sao Paulo a little while ago. Maybe an hour ago. It counts that as corner cutting, even though you're just going along the wall there. Really intriguing. Very, very intriguing. I didn't break enough. But it doesn't matter if I manage to cheese that other part back there. If I don't do these corners well, it's all for nothing. Some cheese can pay off. There's a really good cheese in Montreal that allowed me to get the gold medal pretty easily. In like 19 laps or something. None of the other ones came quite so easily. No slide on. Thank <laughs> you. 
Do, 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 do. I definitely break or break too early, I think. Too early. Had to adjust the round corner. Rest in peace. Look how much faster you catch up with that guy there. That's crazy. You can be pretty reckless. Screw this part. Which I am sure you cannot do, IRL. Well, you can be pretty cheesy there. I didn't do that corner very well. He's already caught up. How is he doing that corner so much better than me? What the fuck? He's doing that one like way better than me. He knows how to do these corners. No! Goodbye. I slid. I did the cardinal sin of sliding. Goodbye. Goodbye, gold medal. Better luck next lap. I wasn't going to get it anyway. Ah! Open two wheels a lot. It's red the quarter cutting on that spot specifically. I like how it's called corner cutting, though. That's my, that's my disagreement. It's not a fucking corner. Why are you calling it a corner cut? Just call it a left to track or something. I take umbrage with the corner cut terminology. I don't deny it's cheesy or whatever. Yeah, that's a corner cut, too. Whee! I, th this is a corner cut. Okay, okay? That's a corner cut. This is corner cut. Not that other shit. That's, that's a corner hug or something. It's not a cut. It's a hug. You can get ahead pretty easily at the... Uh... This part, but then you fuck it all up here. He just get- I don't know what he's doing here. He's doing that corner very well, though. Rip. Those- that two- those last two corners are my real trouble point. Let me figure out how to go through that corner as fast as he is. Or I need to figure out how to puncture his ghost tires. One or the other. We're gonna figure out how to puncture his tires, okay? No, we're shut. Remember how you finished three of the hardest trophies in Dark Souls 3 while using your feet on a controller? You're insane. Overshot. You're insane! Oh, that's gonna be off the track, yet. Yeah. And that's gonna be off the track. And that's gonna be off the track. And this is gonna be really off the track right here. <laughs> need to figure out how to do the corners better. This guy's just straight up better than corners at me. Or better at corners than me. Like, he slows down here or something. What? He does that. He doesn't slide like a little bitch, I'm sure. Doesn't slide like a little bitch, I'm sure. Doesn't slide like a little bitch.
The blisters on your weeks for feet for a few weeks afterwards. My next lap is fucked. Rip. I can beat him with a deficit like this. This would be a shocker. That first turn was pretty good considering the deficit. Ah, that's gonna be a corner cut. Left to track. Okay, this is left to track, okay. That's left to track. That's left to track. This is leaving the track, okay. Come on now, come on now. I should probably actually try to do that section normally. I feel like my main problem is this later section, though, so... I'm kind of hurrying on to get to this part that I suck at. It hurt, I bet, because you kind of got to walk on your feet, you know? Don't you dare ever do that again. You, you got to walk on your feet. You be nice to him. How is he catching up so fucking quick on that corner? What am I doing wrong? Just, I just watching that white dot just immediately catch the fuck up to me. It's amazing. He's like god tier at that corner. Let me figure out his secret. You can see where the car moves, but that doesn't tell you if they're braking, accelerating, what they're doing. I'd have to walk with hands the entire time. Your, your arm muscles would be, like, fucking ripped by the time your feet healed, right? You'd be fucking ready for, um, a hand walking competition, I guess. Rip. I fucked this up majorly. Rip. Big fuck up. Goodbye. See you later. I overshot this too. See you later, alligator. Uh, overshot. Goodbye. That was pretty good, except for the slide at the end. That was like, uh, I shouldn't be there. So that was like 85% good, right? <laughs> I shouldn't be cutting that close on that. Roommate decided to be nice. Aww! Let me don't drop speed and end the turn, pick the long curve. You expect me to like use my brain or something? I'm just driving, man. I'm not putting any thought process into it. I just go with whatever I feel like doing. I ain't planning this shit out. I've tried to feel out how to do the track. Mostly based on what the racing line tells me. That's gonna be a quarter cut. That's not. Okay. Alright. I just go with it. I've looked at guides and shit, and they're like, okay, in corner five, do blah blah, and it's just like, nope. My brain just shuts down as soon as you get to there. My brain does not comprehend the corner 1, 2, 3 through 19 or whatever. I just drive the track. I'm not much of a strat strategizer, I guess. I just kind of do it. He's definitely taking that corner faster than me, though. I'm overdoing this one. Rest in peace and left the track. Yep, dude. -de. I'm doing okay, but I didn't break enough for that one. 
I gotta find the balance between brick and uh, too much and too little and when to accelerate and all that shit. That's not something I'm gonna learn by looking at a map and being like, okay, to do this on corner 12 or whatever. I just kind of go with the flow. So, in other words, I would be really terrible at any strategizing game like Battleship. I'd be awful at that. I don't strategize. I just go for it. I just kind of figure out what works and what doesn't work as I go along. Not very good there. Hello there, buddy. What's up? I break too early. Surprised that wasn't a corner cut. Yeah, break too late. That's gonna leave the track. GG. Basically, I'm the kind of person that will read a tutorial and then remember about 2% of what I read. And then we just go for it. And when I forget the controls, I go open the menu, look at the controls button again. Look at the list of combo attacks again. We just go for it. Hmm. Yeah, breaked a little early there. How dare you get ahead of me! I didn't come at a very good angle for this one. Somehow recovered that pretty well. Oh, I'm gonna off clear. Yep, that's GD. That didn't break at all. I tried to coast it. Could not coast it. Need to break little. Need little breaky break. Oh, it's been three hours. Jeez. I've been doing this for three hours. Well, not this specifically. I was doing Sao Paulo until I beat it. Now we're doing this one until I beat it. I gotta say, I thought I would have won by now, but I am atrociously terrible at these corners. I keep overshooting them. Even though I tell myself not to overshoot them, I keep doing it. Eventually, my hands will get the message and actually do what I want to do. Until then, though, we shall... Keep practicing. I think that's too early again. Get back here, bitch! Who gave you permission to be behind? Well, I'm front. You're supposed to be behind. I can't even say my uh, threats correctly. I'm at the wrong angle for like all this. He does kind of do like a little go off the track right there, I think I could exploit. Because, you know, it's a ghost. It does the same thing every time. It's not like a race where it's going to be slightly different each time. It's going to drive the exact same way each time. I'm probably waiting too long to start applying the gasoline. No, rip. Didn't break enough. 
How are you so good at these coming over? Why can't he be more terrible at them? Corners are supposed to be the AI's weakness in this game. Why is he so good at them? Actually, maybe he's just average and I'm just terrible at him. Ugh. What a horrifying thought. I'm not using all my curves. Oh, that was pretty good. Like orange. Ah. Terrible angle. Rip. Bad angle. Rip, 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 rip. Did that terribly. I'm definitely not keeping this because I can't do the corners well enough to compensate for doing that terribly. Now that's where he's get ahead of me, because they're always faster than me on the straights, so I don't know why. They're 100% always faster than me on the straights. Every single track's been that way. He slows down here for to get ready for this curve here. I didn't do that very well. It's these two in particular I'm just terrible at. I'm not very good at this one either, but I think it's those last two. If I got those two down, I think I'd be clinching this. <laughs> Come back in about 300 laps and we'll get there. Oh, I ripped my next lap. I'm about a second off, huh? Or mimic his shadows on those curves. Yeah! That's the idea. Oh, uh, qu quarter cut. Nope, no quarter cut. Oh, okay. Alright, game. You say so. I think I need to start accelerating sooner there. Do, 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 do. He slows down here to get ready for his big break and zoom off. Rip! I started accelerating too quickly. Send me a postcard. Do, 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 do. Whoa. How dare you be faster than me right now? Too big, too wide. Rest in peace. If you do these curves well, you could actually catch up right there. Ah, except I didn't do that last one very well. You can kind of cheese it a bit. If you can do it right, this section right, you can actually get quite a bit of out of him. Which I've done maybe like three times in my 44 laps. These guys are god at the corner, so, man. I feel like most of the tracks, the AI is not that great at corners, but on this one, they just dialed it up to 11. They're like, okay, we're gonna make this guy really good at the corners here. Drive the, the driver crazy.
My anime. What's up, Tap? How's it going? How you doing tonight? I don't think I need to break that much. Corner cut. Oh, what? Really not? Okay. Alright. Oh, yeah! Rip. Rip right here. This could be a corner cut. Yeah. Because I had both my tires on that. You gotta understand. There's a difference between what my brain says to do and there's what my hand decides to do. No, I didn't want to put both tires on that. That's just what happened. <laughs> hmm. Somebody you know, huh? I think Twitch does have a feature that shows uh, who you're watching or whatever if you're online. There's like some setting for it or something. Somewhere. I turned that off about 5,000 years ago, so I don't know where that setting is, but there's a setting somewhere. Ah, rip. Rip my next lap. Surprisingly, the speed was not too bad. Overshot. And I slid, too. That's a double whammy right there. That's not a killer, though. The killer is the corn wars. What do I do in the corn wars? That's gonna be a corner cut. That's not a corner cut! Okay. Alright. Yeah, I just don't do the corners well. He's already pretty much caught up. I'm not going to get gold until I can do the second half of this track well. Which is apparently much tougher than it looks. It is much tougher than it appears. It, I feel like the corners are deceptive. Maybe it's the racing line. See, I don't. I can't tell what he's doing. I can see where he is, but that doesn't tell me if he's accelerating or not. Maybe I'm braking too much. Maybe I'm not accelerating soon enough. I don't know. Until I figure that out, we are going to be spinning around the same track. Or it'll be until I decide to go to sleep and try again next week. One or the other. All I know is I will get it eventually. All we gotta do is practice. Yeah, I did pretty good that time. That's how you gotta do that. I accelerated too much. Rip. I did pretty good at the start of that, but I fucked it up at the end. Ah, overshot. Left track. Penalized. You're gonna go sleep, so have a good rest of the stream. You too. You have a good sleep. Eight hours, okay? That's what the recommended amount is. It's required. Rip. Overshot that. That was too late, Brick. Yep. That one was way overshot. 
That one was like a mile off, and that one was sliding. So I accelerated too fast. I'm telling you, I know what I'm doing wrong, but it's just making my hands like do the right thing. When you're an old lady like me, you'll understand, okay? It'll be like, your body just doesn't want to do what your hand brains want to do. When you're old and gray, okay? You'll understand someday, young one. It'll be about four to two hours. What? Well, get to sleep right now so you can maximize it. I did not do that well. Now I caught up. You're not 50. You're not old. Oh, thank you. I'm hip and young. Oh, it's so hip to be young. Why does he slow down there? Is that part of his secret to do that so quickly? He's definitely accelerating there because he's getting away from me. He's accelerating by that point. He's accelerating by, like, the time it gets to the apex corner, or whatever you want to call it. I have to try to do the same without go flying off the track. Which means I need to be at the right angle and or right speed and or whatever. Fuck off, game. Yes, I know I left the track. Yes, I know I fucked up my next lap. Why you got, why you gotta tell me that? How dare you? Ah! I overcorrected again. You hate insomnia? Me too. I don't have it, but I hate it too. Screw it. Oh, I'm gonna get a warning. I didn't get a warning? What? You didn't warn me for that one? What? I knew it. If I touch the grass, that's a corner cut. I knew it. I knew it. I gotta practice these stupid gas corners anyway. Yeah, I'm not breaking at the right time. Or I'm not doing it the right time. I need to be accelerating when I get to the corner, but... I didn't... I wasn't at the right speed or angle or something there. Slow down too much. Hmm. He will figure out his secrets. That old one did math to who? I don't know who that was, but uh, rest in peace, though. Time flies, you know. Before you know it, it'll be 21-24. And F1-124 comes out, right? <laughs> Wait, do they just cycle back around and just say F1-24 again? F1 might be quite different by the... I slowed down way too much there, but I wasn't at a good angle, so I kind of felt like I had to. Oh, I think I see what he's doing there. Yeah, that's some autocorrector there. Rest in peace, famous rapper. Music person. Ah, I way overshot that. I wasn't paying attention. I was not paying attention. 
I was kind of looking at chat. That was my fault. Be AFK for an hour. All right, all right, all right. I will be here probably on the same track. Or will I be here? Oh, I'll be here. It'll be about sleepy time by then. These last two tracks, though, are brutal. This one's actually tough in its own way. I thought it was going to be easier than Sao Paulo. It's got its own challenges with the corners. But at least I'm not sliding on wet pavement no more. So, I'll take it. I did this one terribly. Kind of recovered it at the end, though. Hey, Jacob! What's up? What's up? How's it going? How you doing tonight? No! No slide! No slippy slide! No, it's not a water slide! It's a racetrack! No slide! How's he doing so well at this? He's gained so much speed that I just don't have. I'd really like to see what he's doing at that one corner. Like, see the button presses? See what he's doing. He's just better than me at the end here. Order cut. Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to work. I knew I wasn't getting gold. I was desperate trying. Played some Fantasy Star New Genesis. Ooh, I haven't heard of that. It sounds cool, though. Sounds way more exciting than going around in a circle chasing a gold ghost. Why can't I just puncture your tires, man? Let me puncture your tires. Whoop, I'm going off the track here. That didn't break. Did a break. Rest in peace, this lip. <laughs> Gonna go sleep now, detailed. Good night. Hope you can get as much as possible. Tell Insomnia to go. Bleep, 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 bleep. So on and so forth. The snack out here will, will re energize me. Oh, definitely. I don't know about that. Uh. I just need to get these fucking corners figured out, especially that one in particular. He's like visibly slowing down, but then he takes that corner so fast. I don't understand what buttons he's pressing. He's like taking it at an angle so he doesn't have to slow down for the curve after the apex on the opposite side. Hmm. I think he just snuck in a booster there. He's got like a little jet booster on the back of his car there. That's what he's doing. That's what he's doing. That's totally my, my theory. Hmm. Yeah, I'm accelerating too late there. I'm breaking enough there. Rip. Waited too long to 
Or, wait, I, I not waited too long. I accelerated too quickly there. Caused myself to spin. <laughs> Sim racing so complicated. Uh, arcade racing superior, okay? All you gotta do is press buttons and you go fast, right? You don't have all these rules. If I was doing manual gears too, I'd have to keep track of that shit too. That'd probably break my brain. That'd be the end of Prophelia. Overshot it. Break too late. Goodbye. Goodbye, gold car. We're gonna cheese the ketchup to you. We're gonna cheese it. Can't really cheese ketchup to you, but we tried to close the gap somewhat. You can kind of cheese that. But I still gotta do these corners, you know, right? Well, it doesn't matter. He's just straight up better at all these corners than me. He knows how to do them. Maximize speed, and I do not. I'm gonna figure it out. Oh, sliding's not how you do it, bro. Sliding, not how you do it. Rip, left track. Didn't break enough. For the 1200th time. Not a corner cut. That slide's gonna fuck with me, though. Ah, right, bad angle. I knew it! I really just gotta stay away from that side. That side's a picky little finicky bitch. I just gotta stay away from that side. That's what I gotta do. I'm gonna stay the fuck away from the red on that side, or it's just gonna fuck me over. I'm gonna be like, oh, did you sneeze in my general direction? Corner cart! Hmm. Like, what the fuck's he doing to do so well in these corners? I don't know. He probably manual gearing it up. He got ghost manual gears. I don't think that'd give you that much of an advantage, though. I overshot that by five miles, man. Rip. Rip my next lap, probably. Overshot. Overshot! Goodbye! Better luck to X-Lap. This one actually might take me more laps than Sao Paulo. Just because I can't figure out how... To oh, this me left the track. I can't figure out how the fuck this is working. I can't figure out these fucking corners. How I can do them so fast without going off. He's already, he, he's breaking and already accelerating so he, that he doesn't go off here. So he's breaking later and turning so that it's not going off track there. I guess, I don't know. I don't know. He's definitely far more aggressive with his turns or better than like the ones on the other tracks though, that's for sure. He's really fucking good at the turns. 
I feel like they increased his AI for the turn specifically here. Or I just don't know how to optimize Austin's turns. That's probably more likely the answer. He doesn't look like he slows down too much there. Or anywhere, actually. He's a god. How will I ever get to my gold? I'm a whole second behind. What? I didn't have a good time there? God damn it. You could at least tell me what buttons you're pressing gold. I want to understand. Without sliding, bro. It's no good if you slide. You might as well just crash into a wall if you slide. Each means art of gradual acceleration. Left track. Left track, left the track, left the track, left the track. Wah! So I can cheese the shit out of the curves in the beginning, but it doesn't matter because I'm so awful at these corners that he can catch up. I need to at least be good enough that he doesn't catch up. I don't have to be better at the corners than him. I just have to be like about mid same tier or whatever. And I am nowhere near that set, apparently. This is the new Sao Paulo. It's not even raining. I feel like part of that might be the car, though, honestly. I bet I would have gotten this done by now if I was in a Ferrari. This car just not as good though. Like, I keep having to slow down again because there's the corner here, but he is obviously not doing that. He's just accelerating and going for it and not going off the course. He's not really breaking the racing line either. It's really interesting. like staying on the racing line but still not going off the fucking course. I'm having a tough time imitating that. I expended all my cool pro energy on Sao Paulo this week apparently. I don't think we're getting this one done today. This one's actually much more difficult than I thought it would be. It's much more deceptive. Because gold is just so good at the corners. I need to be like god tier at the corners myself if I want any chance in hell. And that's only gonna happen with practice. Rip. Rip. If you do it right, you can get ahead of the AI back at those corners, but that doesn't matter because I'm so trash at this one that uh, I just lose it. Maybe I'll be less trash next week. I'm glad Sal Paulo's done, though. I can't believe this track's actually going to take me more tries than all the other ones. 
Just because I'm not doing corners very well. This one's deceptive or some shit. Or I keep sliding. I don't know. My corner game is Tulsa. I'm no good at corner slot. Therefore, I'm no good at getting gold tonight. I'll just go sit in the corner and think about my life decisions. How did I get stuck on Austin of all tracks? I thought this was going to be one of the easier ones. I was extremely incorrect. I thought this was going to be like Montreal or some shit. It was going to be easy. Ha! Nope. I have to drive like a goddamn robot. <laughs> Even though you can get such a big lead here. This is probably why they made him such a god tier at corners. Because of the fact you can like cheese that. That's probably why they made him so good at corners. That's gonna be a corner cut. That's not a corner cut! Oh, come on now. Now you're just stupid, gay. See, if I try to accelerate, I go off the track. I, what is he doing? If I try to imitate, I go off. What is he fucking doing? Is he just wait, breaking a little later? Did I break too early and try it from too early an angle? What's going on? This guy's doing like trigonometry right now. My brain don't understand. It's the equivalent anyway. This guy's doing some fancy ass shit that I don't understand. He's speeding up in the corner and not going off the track. I don't get why not. Because when I try to do that, I go off track. So all I can conclude is that I have the wrong angle or something. Yeah. Well, oh, overshot that. Hey, no, is this 1.30 in the morning? That's probably having an impact on my performance. Despite my nap earlier. That and the fact that I've been driving for like three hours. The longer you go, the more tired you get to... I'm only human, unlike this gold ghost here. I'm a flawed person. Who cannot be super badass and do cool things. All the time. Only some of the time. Corner cut, corner cut, corner cut. Yeah, do it. All I'm doing is just running on that. And it's a corner cut. I wasn't going to get it this lap anyway, so it doesn't fucking matter. Stop sliding! <laughs> Off the track. Not that matters. I, I see why this is the last one now. It's deceptively simple looking. Hey, do rock can't say much that a difficult controller is? Yeah, that's true. I know what I'm doing wrong, but I don't know how to fix it. He just takes the corner so fast, and I don't know how to do the same thing without going flying off. I wish I could see his controller inputs. Or his baton inputs. Maybe he's- maybe it's the power of manual gears or some shit. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. Well, knows I'm not doing the corners well enough to beat him. Therefore, I have to keep practicing until I do. Or keep practicing until sleepy time, and then keep practicing again next time I play this. Alright. Alright. Rest in fucking peace. Rip. I fumbled that on hard. Like I said, it doesn't matter, because he can do these corners so well, and I try to imitate, and I just don't get the same results. I just slide like an idiot. 
I tried to do the same thing, I just fucking spaz all over the place. All I can do is keep practicing though. I'll get it eventually. My PB is like one second off, that's not too much. I overshot that. One second's a lot in the racing world, but you know. I got close! I spent most of tonight's stream on Sao Paulo, though. Maybe like half of it. Two thirds? I'll look. I started tonight a second behind on Sao Paulo and I managed to win, so. I'll start a second behind next week and maybe we'll win. Who knows? I'm sure there's a reason why this is the last modern track, though. They're not exactly there in terms of how the toughest to the easiest, right? It'd make more sense for the tracks to get tougher as you go along. And this is the last modern one for a reason, I'm sure. They definitely tuned up his AI to be gods here on the corners, though. Because you can cheese the shit out of him at this section, but if you're not good at the corners, it's not going to matter. I've got him ahead of him here, but he's going to catch up to me on the corners because he does the, just straight up knows how to do them better than me. I don't know how to do them without losing all my speed. Apparently. Especially this one right here. He's insanely good at this one, somehow. He just does this one very well. And this one, too. No slide. And then this one, very well. And then I just left the track and invalidated my lap. I try to go fast, I leave the track. Okay? He know, he's programmed to know exactly the right speed and stuff. He can, he can accelerate and decelerate exactly right. I cannot. I'm just human. Especially decelerating. I can't really decelerate gradually because uh, I'm right-handed and decelerating is my left hand, you know? But I can't really gradually break. I don't have the finger left hand muscles for it. I've gotten better at gradually accelerating with my right hand, though. But, you know. It is what it is. That's gonna be a corner cut. I don't know why my hands decided to do that. I did not want to go that direction. My hands and my brain don't agree. That's the other challenge. When you know you know how to do something, but you, your hands don't do it. Stop sliding! I have to be a master of accelerating just right to do this one. That's not happening tonight. I'm too tired for this shit. We're just practicing by this point. Look how fast and well he does this. He breaks right here, but then he's like just fucking gone. He knows exactly how to do it without sliding on the tires at all. He's not a gold ghost for nothing. Ow! And there we go. I accelerated too fast, so I spun out. Time attack's not supposed to be easy, so, you know. I'm gonna struggle! I'm gonna struggle! That's the challenge. If it was easy, it wouldn't have such a low unlock percentage. Oh. For the achievement for getting gold medals and everything. It ha it'd be like 90% of people who played the game unlocked it, but it's not. It's like fucking 2% of people who played the game have unlocked it. For a reason. Ah, shit. I fucked up. I went too far on the outside there. I have screwed up. I'm gonna make 65 my last lap, and then I'm going to sleep. And I'm done with this BS. 
Three hours of practice is good enough for me for that. I'm fully hold down the brake to make the harder turn. Sure, but I'm le not right left-handed. I'm right-handed, so it's hard to gradually decelerate. That's what I was saying. I know gradual deceleration is better, but it's hard to do. Because I am right-handed. And my left hand skipped gym day. You can give me all the tips in the world, but it's not going to change anything. I got to feel it out and I got to drive it myself. I got to just get it by doing it. I could watch all the videos. It's not going to help. Because I'm not going to internalize and figure out any of it. I'm kind of a has to do it to get better at it kind of person. Uh, I improve by doing it. That's, it. That's how I learn. I learn by doing the thing. I don't learn by watching a YouTube video about it. I get like a gradual idea, but I don't like internalize it and memorize it or whatever. I gotta just do the thing. Gotta practice the thing. And that's how we will get it. I knew that was going to be a corner cut. I knew it, but... I, I knew it, but, uh, you know. What was I supposed to do? Not do it? That'd be crazy. As soon as I saw myself go in that direction, I was like, Oh, that's going to be a corner cut. See, overshot. Overshot. And yes, I know outside makes it easier to get to the inside. I know all that. I already know all this. But look how, how he catches up to me on that corner there. He knows how to do that corner to like catch up. Max speed or whatever. Yeah, I've got a PB on that side. And see, he got ahead there. He knows how to do the corners. I just don't know how to do them optimally. The only way I'm going to get that is practicing. I can be ahead at the first part, but if I can't at least do the turn so that he can't gain ground, it doesn't matter. No, oh, I said 65 is going to be the last one. If you had a new set for race, I might send you my wheel because you use the wheels legit lifesaver for racing games. Now, nah, I'm going to control this. I'm pretty close to the end of this game, actually. I've beaten this game on hard difficulty on Season Challenge. That was by far the toughest part. And I did career and it was much easier on amateur. It was very nice. I've gotten like all the achievements except Time Attack. And then one I've set up for last. That's it. I'm like 98% done with this game. I'm doing the final big challenge. It's just Time Attack. This is the last of the modern tracks. Times are good. Achievement unlocked. I guess the classic track doesn't count for that one. That's the one for getting a, me a medal on every time attack track. Not a gold one, though. So, my times are pretty comparable in Sector 1. But I'm like a hundredth too slow. And I'm like, whoa, I'm super slow in Sector 3. Oh, wait, that's the second half. Of the, that's like the last part of the track. That is where I need to improve it, Sector 3. That's where I need to get. Uh, the, last, the last part is the part I need to improve on. I don't care about no silver medal. I want my gold medal. But not today. Ian's too tired. It's not happening today. We got Sao Paulo done today, though. Yeah, like I said, I'm not getting the racing wheel for a 360 game. And we see, see, if we're going, if we're going left, to right, this one's gotta be tougher, right? The one at the end's tougher, right? It goes from easier to harder, right? Melbourne was pretty tough, though. 
I've gotten gold on the other five tracks. Sao Paulo was brutal, though. Sao Paulo is really tough, but we got it done today. We're about a second too slow for this one. Next time, we will be doing this one until we get gold. We'll have to get those corners down. We'll have to figure it out. Gotta get it done. We managed to beat all these other ones. So you know what's going to happen? We're going to beat this one too. It just requires X amount of practice. And when we do that, then we will go over to F1 Classics. And we will do the final challenge. The gold medal on this one. Which is apparently, according to the guide anyway, the toughest one of them all. <laughs> It'll be exciting. But that's not for today. For today, that's it. And the not video games for today. For today. No. Hands are tired. Can only drive around in a circle. It's hardly any breaks for so long. My hands are definitely tougher than they were when I started this game, though. My right finger, index finger, holds down the accelerator stronger, I can tell. But yes. We will get it done. Which one's that? Mercedes-Benz? Oh, that's the car it is? Hmm, that's one of the worst ones, isn't it? I don't know. It's not one of the good ones that I remember. I don't have them all memorized. Too bad I can't choose my car. I'd pick Ferrari because it has the best handling. That's why they won't let me do it. They know my tricks. Go make a pro tin shake for your proness. Yeah! There we go, there we go, there we go. And then the next time I show up, I'll be like, Hey guys, I got all the muscles now. Flex. Now I now I can accelerate and decelerate gradually with both hands. Totally. I think I'm better at decelerating gradually than I was when I started, but I'm still not left-handed, so it's still tough to do. I'll have to figure it out. Perhaps we will beat Austin next time. Or perhaps not. Perhaps I'll just be going around in a circle the whole time. Who knows? I'll be there until I figure out how to do the corners. If the AI can go through them so quickly, which boggles my mind. I try to do that, and I either spin, if I lose speed, or I go too fast and go off the track. I have to find the balance. And I have not yet become good enough to find the balance! It's okay though. We got Sao Paulo done to this, so I'm happy. One gold medal is good enough for me. I'm not greedy. I've definitely been getting tougher as been going along though. Like uh, last last stream, I got the first four tracks done in the same stream. I got four gold medals last stream. I got stuck on Sao Paulo. I got Sao Paulo done today, and now I'm stuck on Austin. These last two tracks in particular are brutal. For different reasons though. Sao Paulo because it was rainy and I was sliding everywhere. And this one because I haven't figured out how to do the corners optimally yet. But we're going to figure it out. Because we're going to practice until we get it. <laughs> That's how you beat a video game or really pretty much anything in life, right? You practice until you beat it. That's how it works. You got better at anything with practice. And eventually I will. It'll click. It'll figure it out. Right now it's not clicking. Maybe because it's almost 2 in the morning. Baby, baby, baby. Well, I'll figure it out though. 
Thanks for hanging out, Will. Uh, you take care of yourself. Thanks for hanging out, Jacob. And uh, everybody else who stopped by earlier, I think, went to sleep. You guys have a good time. Thanks for hanging out, Cat. Hi, real Mexican boy, Dobie, Gido, Alterator, everybody. Alterator, everybody. I will return for more driving on this next week. Tomorrow I'll be back with some uh, Neptunia. Maybe we'll beat the final boss. We're getting pretty close. I thought we were going to get to the final boss last week. So I'm, all, I'm always far behind. I was like, oh, no, not quite yet. Oh, now shit's getting real. Okay, maybe now. Maybe now. Maybe now this time. Maybe, maybe, maybe. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Whoosh. For now, though. Sleep time. <laughs>